hey guys oh my gosh i got two exciting pieces of news the first one is um thank you thank you thank you i've had over 1000 channel views i just checked it and it said 1002 channel views so thank you thank you thank you so much and um the second thing is um i found it yesterday when i started uploading my first video and in, I am now able to upload videos longer than 15 minutes um, because my, apparently um, YouTube said congratulations my account has been enabled to upload videos longer than 15 minutes and because it's my 18th birthday this year so I might actually have a haul that will prob might be longer than 15 minutes it might be because it's my 18th so it might be quite huge yeah and also I might not show you the birthday my birthday presents in a haul until after I've got all my presents from friends, family, fiance, parents, uh my fiance's parents possibly. Yeah last year. Right, my fiance um gave me a massive card and it said because I didn't really know his parents it said his parents name and then Auntie's mum and dad and I was like it was just signed by them and not by Auntie I was thinking babe can't next year this was last year I was thinking babe can't next year when I'm 18 actually sign my cup so basically yeah I can upload videos longer than 15 minutes and thank you for everyone who's been watching my videos. Thank you to all my 8 subscribers. I've subscribed to nearly 200 people now, which is crazy. I think it's nearly 200 still. Yeah, I think it's nearly 200 still. It might be 200. I'm so tempted to check, but I bet not. It's either nearly 200 or 200 now, so. Or over 200, I'm not sure. So, yeah. So. I want to show you what I want for my birthday from the Argos catalogue. Now, the only iPad they've got in here is the iPad because when they brought this out, this is a spring summer 2011 one. When they brought this out, they, the iPad 2 won't come out, but I kind of want the iPad 2 because I have feeling the iPad is 9 inches, but I think the iPad 2 is like 9.7 inches or something like that. It's crazy. I want the Blackberry Playbook, that's um, 7 inches. I want the HTC Flyer, that's 7 inches. But the thing is, is once I'm 18, um, I can do this thing in the Clarefin Warehouse where you get a free phone and a free tablet for like a certain amount of money per month. So I either get the Wildfire S or the Chacha with the Flyer and the Blackberry Curve something. Not the um, 8520, it's the other... Blackberry something, 9300 or something. Um, yeah, with the Blackberry Playbook. And we're not sure about the Playbook, so we're going to try the Flyer. I might try and do two, but if not, I do one. Um, Anthony's going to have the Wildfire S, which is the one we're choosing, and I'm going to have the tablet, but I will share the tablet with him because I know. I don't know why he said I could have the tablet. Probably because it would be my contract, my money. So basically, yeah. So yeah, I just thought I kind of sh sh well not really show you, but like, tell you what I want to get. Well, seven hundred pound. I don't want to get it. It's called a woven ink seed patio set. It's six hundred ninety nine nine ten. Seven hundred pound. Wow. Oh my gosh, this is this is one thousand three hundred pounds. Thing, it's crazy. Some of these things. I don't want them. I was just looking. I was like, oh my gosh. It's like a yacht. Right. I'm into the electrical. I always look at the electrical stuff. Okay. Uh, first of all, the first gift I want. My TV is rubbish. It's one of them old, um, is it called monotone? I think it's called monotone TVs. It's one of them um, old, I think it's called monotone TVs, like one of those really old TVs. And I want an up to date one, um, just in case I get like Sky or Virgin or something. Yeah. Which I probably won't get, 
um, unless I'm 18, because you have to go... One, um, you can have Sky under 18, but only your parents can pay, or foster parents, or whatever, step parents, whatever. Basically, yeah. Can pay, um, if you're under 18 for, like, Sky and Virgin. But once you're 18, um, you can go with Sky. I know you can go with Sky, I'm not sure about Virgin. But sorry, I'm doing all these hand movements. Hello, hello. I'm not American, but I'm from the UK, England. I'm not really gonna tell you what town, but I'm from. I love where I live, actually. It's kind of a rough place. It's kind of not rough, but then it's kind of rough. Like certain parts are kind of rough, but other parts are kind of not posh, but kind of not rough, but kind of not. But I find this town sort of rough. Just because I do. It's kind of... I don't know. It says on Facebook how many people live here. Um, on like the thing. If you type in my town's name. You can get it up. And then basically... Yup. Yeah. Basically I'm from Hampshire. In England. In the UK. That's what I'm telling you. I'm not actually going to tell you the town. Because there are so many towns in Hampshire. So yeah, so first of all, um, sorry if I'm looking down, it's because I kind of got the, um, I might actually bring it higher. I might actually, sorry, I just bothered the speaker it's on. So yeah, first of all, I want the, it's called the Bush 22 inch full HD um, 1080p LED TV. Uh, it's the lowest priced, it's 149 99 so it's like £150. Um, it's LED, HD ready, 1080p, you get digital and you also get freeview built in. Because my fiance's TV has freeview built in. I think his cost about a £1,000 or over a £1,000. I think it was from um, Littlewoods and I think his mum paid for it. Um, so it is, yeah. I want a TV with a DVD thing, but the problem is, is to me, they're either too expensive or they're too small. Like, is this one, that's £130, but it's 19 inch with DVD, which is kind of not good. Because my fiance has got a 22 inch, but when we live together, um, I really, really want like a 50, 55, 60, sorry, I've got really good choice. Um, 50, 55, 60 inch TV, because then when we play on our game console, things are like Apparently there's going to be a new Xbox coming out, my fiancé was saying, but I'm not sure because the um, latest Xbox only came out um, around June, May, around June last year. The one I've got and the the full gig one and the 250 gig one, the um, Xbox 360S, I think it is called, um, yeah, I think it came out around May, June, July last year, so, yeah. Yeah, so I've got to kind of flick through because it's kind of, kind of can't find what I want. Here we go. I don't really want an MP3 player. I want a DVD, a portable DVD player. My fiance's got an MP3 player. He's got an MP3 player and an iPod Nano. Although technically, the iPod Nano is his dad's. Right. He, Anthony, um, dad, his dad lied about something, about giving him, um, about his dad giving Anthony, my fiance, his old phone, which his dad gave to Anthony's brother. So he let Anthony have the iPod. Um, Michael took it off him, and then Michael, his brother, um, wasn't at the house at the time. And it was still in Michael's room, so Annie took it, um, basically, yeah. Kind of cool beans. And Annie's like, keeping it for good. And also, it's really cool, right? Because, um, the other week, um, Annie found this PSP 3003, a red one, on the floor in Michael's room. We kept that in a drawer, so I think Michael didn't take it. The thing is, it's got a back cover, but not a battery. And, one tip. Um, this person... And the game store in town, right? We asked for our last PSP for a battery. It was either a battery or something. And they said they didn't sell them. If you buy them online, you have to be very, very careful. Because some of them you put in the PSPs can explode. 
apparently so you have to be really careful buying them online because apparently some of them you put in the PSP will and can explode so let's see how so taking the time 10 20 do 20 okay my mum tapped me tapped that on the wall tapped my bath like ages ago so my back's really hard me because I'm kind of sitting on the floor and I kind of like can't lean back unless I lean back like that but that's like too far away from the Excuse me, webcam. My fiance's got that. The iPod. No, no. Um, the blue one he's got. He's got the blue one. I quite like the pink one, actually. Uh, I don't know if it's the 8 gig or the 16 gig. I'm not sure. Uh, I'll tell you a bit about each iPod, actually. Sorry, I've kind of got to lean like this because it's kind of easier. Um... Actually, I might need some more. laptop. Sorry, guys. It's kind of a change around. Sorry, if you see, like, my ladder. Because it's my bed. Because I've got a high bunk bed. If you're wondering what that is, that's my chest of drawers. And that's kind of a box with a laptop. So. Oh, my foot's gone funny. Sorry, guys. My foot's just gone really funny because I'm sitting on it. Um, yeah, the iPod Shuffle. It's cool. it says here the new clip and glow go it's a glow I meant go iPod Shuffle has hundreds of songs and multiple playlists now with buttons and over voice to make it even easier to play your music. My mum has an iPod Shuffle. It's two gig holding five hundred songs. The battery life says it lasts fifteen hours. There's no video playback and it's rechargeable. All iPods are rechargeable by via USB. The iPod Nano, which my fiance has, uh, reads lined for music and multi-touch. So I've got read really itch. Um, clip on iPad Nano and take music everywhere. The anodized aluminium finish makes this new design even more brilliant. Eight gig holding two thousand songs and sixteen gig holding four thousand songs. Common features. It also has common features. The battery life says it lasts twenty four hours, so around one day. No video playback. And as I said, all iPods are retired via USB. Some people say via, but I said uh, iPod Classic. The iPod Classic. Now, the iPod Classic hasn't been redesigned since 2009. So that is the design. The iPod Classic is designed from 2009. It wasn't designed again last year. Um, I don't know why. There is rumours of an iPod Touch 5G, meaning fifth generation. But my dad said the other month that. Um, Apple won't be making any more iPods, so I'm not sure if that's going to be true or not. The iPod Classic. The iPod Classic comes with 160 gig. If if I say gig, it means gigabyte of storage in the same compact size. It holds up to 40,000 songs, 200 hours of video, 25,000 photos, or any combination. 160 gig, 40,000 songs, 200 hours of video. Um, the battery life is about 36 hours. Um, video playback, yes. And as I said, all oh, iPods are driving by USB. iPod Touch. I'm hoping to get one for my birthday because I'm 18, basically. The iPod Touch. See friends while you walk, talk, I mean, walk with FaceTime. Shoot HD video or play games against friends or unknown foes with Game Center or viewed on the amazing wrestling display. 8 gig holds 2,000 songs, 10 hours of video, 32 gig holds 8,000 and 40 hours of video. Now, I think Argos kind of lied about the 64 gig. I think most shops say it holds 14,000 songs, but Argos say it holds 16,000, so I'm not sure on that. And 80 hours of video. The battery life says it lasts around 40 hours. Yes, video playback, and as you all iPods are driving by it, USB. Uh, that's the touch. The yeah, iPod Touch, there's like different things about it, about the video, display, gaming, FaceTime, music, mail, internet, video, app store, entertainment, social networking and information. And then there's the shuffle and there's the classic. This is the shuffle, that's the classic. I quite like the shuffle in pink, I think my mum's got the shuffle in green. Yeah. I think the 8 gig iPod Touch is actually cheaper than the iPod Classic. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, I want a, if I do get an iPod Touch, I want the iPod Touch hard shell case. Um, so you for iPod Touch 4G, 4th generation. I'll either get it in pink or white or mirrored effect or black. 
I can't look at it in white actually, it's kind of sleek. I mean the mirror effect's already on the back of the uh, iPod, so. It's a queen, yeah. Um, I want the Skull Candy Dubs in a headphones in white. They're £10. And I want to see Skull Candy logo, the headphones, pink and white, which is £34.99. So basically, yeah, they're £35. Pounds. And the in the dog headphones, things are actually £9.99. So yeah, £10.35. Um, my fiance has some black and gold ones. Um, Skull Candy Low Rider headphones. Um, his brother broke them. We think his brother, his brother Michael and their dad says Michael broke them on by accident, but we think he broke them on purpose to Auntie because they're ex quite expensive, so Auntie couldn't use them again. If I do get an Apple Touch, I want to get the Bosch 90 watt iPhone slash iPod speaker up. It's seventy four ninety nine. It looks like that. Look how look how bassy that would be. Ninety watts. Yes, remote included. Ninety watt speaker pair, MP3 compatible, and it's powered by the main. Built in the subwoofer for powerful powerful bass. The previously installed price. Um, charged between the thirteenth of October two thousand ten and the twenty first of June two thousand eleven was actually there's an iPod speaker dot for hundred pounds. Well, it says iPod, uh, iPad, iPhone, and iPod, but it just says iPad compatible. Oh, that probably means it's iPod pad compatible as well as iPod and iPhone. I'm gonna get a DAB. I can't I'll probably not get one for my birthday. I so want to get this. It's a fillet. Well, it says. A a mini hi-fi system is $299.99 it's £300 the power in output is 600 watts um, FM and MW tuner bands 20 station presets and yes for MP3 per bit yes for USB port it's that one there look at it look how bassy that would be seriously I think the two things on the side of the speakers, and I think the separate thing must be, uh, I think it might possibly is the subwoofer. It's called a subwoofer. I really want a sat now. I really want like a digital camera because, because I do, just because I do, I think that's it. Oh no, I want a phone. Well. Me and my fiance Anthony think blackberries are just gonna like die because they're dying at the moment. But I want the Blackberry Curve 520 again, but uh, it says it's 149.99 plus 10 pound at times. So it's like 150 pound. So it's like 100 around 160 pound. That's the old wildfire, they're selling the old wildfire until the autumn winter one comes out properly. My fiance tried to get the San Francisco on several occasions, he hasn't managed to get it. It's Android, he needs a new phone anyway. So basically, yeah, the chacha won't be in here because it's too new. This came out like last year for the spring summer this year. So. Did it come out last year? I can't remember when I actually got it. My fiance is getting an Apple Mac. I have a feeling he's getting a MacBook, either a MacBook Pro or a MacBook Air. I'm going to get a MacBook because the MacBook Air 11 inch lasts 5 hours, the MacBook Air 13 inch lasts 7 hours, and the MacBook Pro, or the MacBook Pro, the 13 inch lasts 10 hours, and the 15 inch lasts 10 hours. But the MacBook, the notebook for everyone, 13 inch actually lasts 10 hours. I really want to get the iMac, which is the 21 and a half inch thing. I think Anthony was actually going to get that at first, but I think he might be getting the MacBook Pro or the MacBook Air now. He's getting a MacBook. It's pretty cool because we're not going to college anymore. When is his birthday, which is the week after mine, the 16th of October. Mine's the 9th of October. His is the 16th of October. So, um, basically, yeah. So, um, yeah, he's getting a MacBook. Um, my mum has something Apple, he has something Apple, and if I get an iPod Touch, I'll have something Apple, so. Basically, yeah. Uh, I want to, I really want to get the, um, oh no, the iPad is 9.7 inches, I thought the iPad was 9 inches. I really, 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 sorry, I 
said it wrong, it's 9.7 inches the iPad, same as the iPad 2. I so want to get the iPad 2, the problem is it's really expensive. Because at first when the iPad 2 came out, I wanted to get the iPad with Wi-Fi and 3G, and the 64 gig one I wanted to get is £699. So. Oh, my fiancé needs a hard drive. Because his laptop, right? Uh, doesn't actually have a hard drive in the laptop because I think his brother um, mucked, messed up the hard drive or something like messed the hard drive up or something like that. And I think it must have got taken out and there's like no hard drive where there should be one. And my fiance needs a hard drive, but I don't need the hard drives to actually go into the actual laptop. They're like portable hard drives. Which I have to carry around, I assume. Desktop hard drive, there you go. The thing is, is they're so expensive. Ah! There's one here for 100. You see, the thing is, as I said, I'd get him like an iPod Touch or a PS3 or a tablet. Like, I mean, a tablet, I mean, like a PC tablet. But if he still needs a hard drive by the time around his birthday, I may have to get him a portable hard drive because otherwise it's going to bug me so much. My dad actually says, because um, me and Anthony go to a car boot near, like, right next to the town centre where we live and um, it's in the multi-story car park. And there are hard drives there, but the problem is, is they might like be broke or have water damage and stuff. So, basically, yeah. We saw this laptop yesterday, and we were going to wait for the person to come back to ask how much it is. Then Auntie put it down and thought, well, I think it might have water damage. So, it looks like proper alright, but he thought it might have water damage. I really want a... I don't know why, I just want like a memory stick thing, like with flash drives and flash pens and stuff. I think my fiance has a Sandisk Cruise USB flash drive. The thing is, is I'd want to get 32 gig, but 32 gig is very expensive. Basically, yeah. Moles! Sorry, I'm like obsessed with moles and whippets and Great Danes and ducks. That's how I say maybe. Mm -hmm. Of course, I'm mice. Mice. Mice is Anthony calls it, but it's actually mice. Mice. When he calls a mouse a mice, which is really annoying. It really bugs me when he does that. He calls a mouse a mice. Cool, well, an 18 and a half inch GFT monitor, just to know. Okay, sorry guys, I better uh, end this video because I've only got half an opportunity. Um, me and my fiance, oh no, maybe not, maybe not, because we might be going there if it's not too expensive. Um, I'll just quickly show the pajamas um, yesterday, last night. Sorry, it's inside out, it's because I was kind of, kind of. I don't think I was rushing as such, but kind of rushing. So, um, basically, yeah, so it just looks like this. It's like white with navy polka dot, and like a navy button, and like blue and white piping kind of thing. And then it, these are from Marks and Spencers, but I'm not actually sure where I got them from. I'm not exactly sure. Um, and then, sorry guys, I don't even know. And these are the cute, um, shorts because it's kind of hot it was really hot yesterday it was meant to go out to like 31 32 degrees today in the uk in some parts of the uk but yeah i want to show you this um i got this mug and it was 39p from oxfam i bought it last year because this is the 8th of may 8th of may and i didn't buy it this year i bought it last year because i heard the other day that oxfam really got it from so, well, I actually never go. I think I've only been once so far. 
Yeah, and it's got like this fairy, and then this fairy, and it's got Tinkerbell. And I bought it because I because of Tinkerbell. I have a feeling one of the fairies. I have a feeling there is a fairy called um, Jasmine. I think it might be that one or a fairy similar to that fairy. Um, I think there's a fairy called Jasmine or is that a princess? It's either a fairy or a princess. I'm not sure. Please comment and tell me whether Jasmine is a fairy or a princess because I have heard of a fairy or a princess called Jasmine. Yeah, so yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video, so comment, rate and subscribe, see you soon guys, take care, and I'll see you in the next video, okay, bye guys, love you lots, bye, sorry.